Hey, what's up, guys? This is your boy, Sherry Speaks, man. We back at it again, man. Shout out to TMZ. And shout out to Lamar Odom and Bam Margera, man. Now, if y'all don't know, my boy Bam's been going through with his own personal sobriety. I mean, sub substance issues. And it's from, from what I'm reading right now, man, Bam Margera, he got released from a psychic hold, man, psych hold. And he's headed straight to Lamar's rehab, which is, if you don't remember, Lamar told him, like, hey, man, when you're ready, come to my rehab, to one of my rehab facilities out here in California, and I'll get you right. And it seems as though Bab is finally doing that, man. I'm happy to see and hear that. Now, sources familiar with the situation tell TMZ, the former Jagger star was released from a psych hospital Wednesday. Lamar was there to greet him as he exited the facility. We're told Bam is now in detox at one of Lamar's locations before he heads to rehab at another spot owned by the former NBA star. That's fire. Now, Lamar has been insistent on helping Bam for weeks and even visited him in the hospital Tuesday to offer Bam treatment at one of his Odom Wellness Treatment Centers. Now, Bam's motivating factor is getting, in getting clean is definitely his young son, Phoenix, who he hasn't been able to see much during his battles with substance abuse. Uh, TMZ broke the story. Obviously, cops in L.A. tracked Bam to Trejo's Tacos location over the weekend and placed him on a 5150 psychiatric hold. Uh, there was growing concern Bam was only... A, was not only a danger to himself, but others to, as well, especially given the fact he threatened to end his life if you couldn't see his son. There we go. And nonetheless, guys, I'm happy that, you know, he's just getting his right. He's getting himself right. I'm happy for that, man. So we'll see what happens with that, man. Real talk. One love.